a wine drinker, you likely have a wine glass in your cabinet. That's right, but I bet you don't have glassware quite like the kind today's Minnesota homemaker makes. So reporter Kelly Hansen is here with the beautiful work from Madison Marty Designs. Hi Kelly. Hi you guys. These okay. are cool. Aren't they looking. very, very cool? So Madison Marty Designs, it's painted glassware. Okay, so you've got your pint glasses, you've got your highballs, your wine glasses, lots of different glass items that she paints. Mm -hmm. um, it is Madison Marty is the artist and she lives in Woodbury. Um, so this started during the height of COVID, which I feel like is a common theme. Yeah, it really is. Homemakers, <laughs> what what right? do I do with my time? Right. Well, I'm so bored. What do I do? Uh, so she was doing that. She was bored. She wanted to start painting, started with canvases, but thought, I want to paint something that people can use. <laughs> Gee, I wonder what she was doing when she was like, what was everybody doing during the pandemic? Having some wine. Yeah, Having the some recycling wine. was Having clinking little, and right? clinking so out there. She, she wanted to bring something to your life that you could use that had art in it. Take a listen. I definitely started painting as kind of an outlet after a stressful day at work. Um, so yeah, I really get in the zone and I laugh because my fiance will be upstairs and I'll make something new and I'll have to run up there and go show him and be like, oh my gosh, what do you think of this? And she loves what That's she does. That's so cute. She loves it. Okay, so these are very cool. The glassware, yeah, I'll tell you a little bit about it. So okay. it's painted with acrylic paint, and then she puts a resin over it. I can see that. Which like seals it, right? She says hand wash only. Hand though. wash. There's a hard and fast rule, which is hand washing. Do not put these in the dishwasher. No. Here is why. You Take can't even listen. do it when they're screen printed. Yeah. No, no. Let's Take a listen to why you shouldn't do it. Okay. So the resin, when it cures, it creates kind of like a plastic barrier to the outside of the glasses. Um, it adheres to the glass really nicely, so the paint won't scratch off or anything like that. Um, but yeah, you can't put them in the dishwasher because resin can't handle the very high heat, so it will cause it to uncure and it will ruin the glasses. Okay. Well, even when you get, because I have gotten pint glasses like for Jay that have like Wisconsin on it, mm -hmm. and then the, just hand wash it. If yeah, you don't because know. if I put them in the dishwasher, it fades. Like, well, that, you, you probably should do that. Yeah, just hand wash it. Yeah, if you, you don't probably know. need that I W to fade a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Wash. I do like. I do like the, um, yeah. the way she labels these. Like these ones right here with this dark color. You guys, everybody in Minnesota should know what color palette that is. It's walleye. It's a walleye. It's a walleye. This one's a monarch. I really just think they're just beautiful. Look at this one. This one down here is a loon, and <gasps> she's put like the little red eye on I love there. when we use just the Just the attention to detail. I what else, though? Balloons. Like, okay, because it's not just the glasses that right. you can use. You have these other fun things. She's got other products. So she has magnetic drink charms, which are down here. Aren't those so cool? So you can just put them like on your little glass. Wait, and then, well, how do those work? Wait a minute, is there a magnet know. on the other side? Yeah, dig it. Oh, 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 it, oh, it just fell off because yes. So I guess you take yeah. the magnet and you just put and it on. And it's pretty strong. You don't want it to fall on your wine, but it's it's very strong. That's better than the charms because yeah. the charms don't apply to stemless Aren't things. Aren't those cool though? So if you just have a regular, you know, piece of glass or, you know, your simple wine glass, mm -hmm. you can add a little charm. She also has wine stoppers oh. and she has some jewelry. So she's thinking outside of the box of maybe you aren't a drinker. You can put water in this, you know, you could put pop in this. Yeah. But, but if you don't want these things in your home, maybe you want to try a few other things like, like jewelry. So her website, she has so many beautiful designs. I did warn her. I think I warned her. Hmm, I hope that, so. Well, um, warn her now. She might, you know, Madison, if you're watching, which I'm guessing you are, you might be uh, a little busy on your website. People Please are going to check know. it out, which oh, yeah. is very Give us an update. Fun. You know, I think, though, the bottom line about COVID, you know, it, this the one silver lining mm -hmm. was the true understanding that we, although you had a lot of time, you kind of got that you don't have endless time in your life. And so you right. should use the time that you mm -hmm. have to do something that you love. And yeah. I've loved seeing the creativity and people pursuing passions that maybe they'd kind of forgotten were within them. Right. She's always loved art. She's got musicians and artists in her family. And so she just wanted to tap into this and see what would come of it. And she's been very successful. You know, she left her full time job a year ago and she wow. does this full time so you can shop her website we've got the link on our website um, and then she's got different markets she does a lot of different stores in the twin city she's selling at so she's busy she's a busy bee very cool kelly she's gonna be a lot more busy after mm -hmm. this nice job okay so kelly's always looking for ideas if you know of a minnesota homemaker you think kelly should feature email us at twin cities live at kstp.com and we are back with more right after these messages